Hello everyone, myself Praveen and in this video we are going to see amazing product mini Wi-Fi USB adapter. The minimum product is terabytes 500 Mbps mini wireless USB adapter. In this video we are going to see regarding this product unboxing installation of USB adapter with drivers as well as software after successful installation we are going to see we can use this device in two modes first one is as an access point which we can use at hotspot and second mode is like client where we can use the client mode for desktops or PCs to connect to Wi-Fi router with the help of this USB adapter as wireless network card. So let's get started. On the front side, you will see at the top corner 500M mini wireless USB adapter, then company name and model number which is W777MI. This product will offer 3 years warranty but it's limited warranty. On the back side, you will see barcode sticker of Vistara Terabyte Mini 24 GHz wireless Wi-Fi dongle 500 Mbps 802.11 N USB connect at the bottom, the address of company, email ID and phone number. Regarding compatibility, this device will be compatible with Windows from XP to the latest version of Windows. Now let's unbox it. We have CD which contains device driver for USB adapter, then USB adapter and container. On CD, there is company logo and name. At the bottom side, they have printed wireless network adapter, driver and user guide and PDF reader. CD version is 4.1. You can see USB adapter which is pretty compact. The quality of adapter is good as compared to its price range. Its regular USB 2.0. On the top, they have given 802.11 N for wireless connection. So finally, we have CD, USB adapter, container in box. First of all, we are going to insert USB adapter into USB port of your computer. After inserting USB adapter into USB port, you will get message like this installing device driver software you will get message that device driver software was not successfully installed then just close this message then with product we got one CD with device driver software insert this CD into your CD or DVD drive You will get pop-up window select open folder to view files now in disk you will get two folders first one is mdk that is mediatek and second one is realtek now these two folders we require for installation of device on your computer after some days your cd may get scratches so it will be better to copy these two folders into your hard drive so i am copying these two folders ctrl c then creating one folder on desktop
तेरह बाईस Now, after copying these two folders from your disk into your desktop, open MTK folder. In that, if you are having Windows operating system. Then open Windows folder and run the installation. Will start in installation window. You will see at first license agreement of MediaTek. So accept terms of license agreement. Then click on next. Here we have to select. setup type there are two setup type first one is install drivers and mediatek wlan utility and second one is install driver only we are going to select install driver and mediatek wlan utility so make sure radio button in front of first option get selected click on next now we are ready to install click on install button you will see installation progress after completing installation click on finish button and you will get mediatek application or software interface in this mediatek software you can see at the top the first button is of available networks when you click on this button you will see available networks window separately in this window you can see available wifi networks to get access in my case i have one available network at this time in this window again you can see here the rescan button when you click on this available list a rescan the second button is add to profile so regarding this button we are going to see in the latter section now again in main application window the second button is link information when we click on link information button we can see link information like link status then throughput and statistic currently we are not connected to any network so it is showing blank the third button in main window is profile setting when we click on this button we will get separate window for profile list we can create here separate profile the different buttons in this window are add to add profile delete to delete selected profile then edit import export and add vps profile the fourth button in main window is advanced when we click on that we will get advanced window here which will show install certificate and at bottom we can see here certificate details like issuer version subject type valid from and valid to the fifth button in main window is about when we click on that we will get about window which will show the version of utility driver and sdk it will also show mac address finally before close button we have help when we click on help we will get help window for this application which will show content wise topics regarding wireless usb adapter so all the help regarding usage of this particular application get obtained in this help so till now in this video we have seen unboxing installation process of drivers and 
different options available in this application. Now in the next part we are going to see how to use different options and two basic modes available as hotspot and client. Thank you.